What's up, YouTube world? This is Steven again. It is currently 9.43 p.m. on February 22nd of 2022, and I would like to welcome you all to my top 10 song reviews list from song review number 1 to song review number 500. That's right. I'm going to be giving you my top 10 list out of all 500 song reviews I have done, including a honorable mentions list with 15 honorable mentions on it. This list, mark my words, was one of the most difficult uh, lists I've ever had to compile. So, uh, oh, I'm also recording this on Tuesday, but I'm going to be uploading it tomorrow, probably during the early morning hours, like 12 or 12.30 or so. So that is going to be my video for Wednesday. But without further ado, let's get, let's get right into this list and give you my top 10 song reviews from 1 through 500. Coming in at number 10 is is Murder by Before I Turn, song review number 124. This has got to be one of Before I Turn's most heaviest, like, one of their heaviest songs I've ever heard, minus Solitary Forever. Solitary Forever is probably their heaviest, uh, but this one was definitely very chuggy with the guitar and the drums, and the gutturals in the song were phenomenal, along with the hard headbanging breakdowns and also the lightning quickness of the drums as well. I really enjoyed that and it was definitely worthy of a uh, top 10 on my uh, on my 1 through 500 song reviews list. Coming in at number 9 is Fermented Oval Discharge by Necrophages song review number 233. This has one of the best uh, guitar solos I have ever heard in any Necrophages song minus um minus only ash remains i believe is the name of the song that i think that's their best guitar solo but this is their second best along with the uh, gutturals from muhammad i think is the lead vocalist's name uh, unfortunately this band is no longer um together they disbanded back in the uh, early to mid 2000s but this was definitely one of their better songs and i am really glad that i decided to listen to this one i absolutely love that guitar solo and that's what gave it a uh, top 10 mention on my top 10 list. Coming in at number 8 is Situationship by Above This, song review number 433. This had the best, I guess, mix of instruments and vocals out of any Above This song. This one even had cleans. It's so, so rare when you hear cleans from any song by Above This. It's just insane, along with some great gutturals as well, and great drumming that was um, gave it a great rhythm, especially during the chorus, and the guitar really kicked in during the chorus. I think the cleans were what mainly gave this song a top 10 spot on my top 10 list. Definitely worthy of one, either way. Coming in at number 7 is Bow Down by I Prevail, song review number 15. That's right, we're going all the way back to the first 50 to get to this one, number 7, being my 15th song review, and that's Bow Down by I Prevail. I really, really enjoyed this song. This one is probably either one of their heaviest, if not their heaviest song. The breakdown of this was absolutely insane. I mean, it just... It just really slapped from beginning to end. It was an absolute banger. I completely loved every aspect aspect of it, along with the uh, cleans by Brian, which were just completely amazing, and um, a very, very catchy uh, chorus, and great drumming, and great guitar play. The guitar play was great during the hard headbang breakdown, too. And this song was actually what invented the hard headbang breakdown on all of my... Uh, on all of my song reviews because this was the first one I did a hard head bang breakdown to. <laughs> so it was def definitely worthy of a mention. Coming in at number 6 is Final Lipton by Above This, song review number 346. That's right, Above This, you were the only band that made it twice on my top 10 list. And this one was definitely worthy of a top 10 mention because this is the only song review out of all 500 that I had to give a breakdown warning to. There had to have been either 4, 5, maybe 6 breakdowns in this song along with some amazing completely insane gutturals and just some heavy bass dropping in this song in general loved the uh, drums loved the guitar in this song as well and the vocals were pretty pretty funny and i just absolutely love this song in every way shape and form 
Coming in at number five is Black Heart by Within the Ruins, song review number 176. This one had either two or three guitar solos in it, along with at least two, maybe three breakdowns. I believe I gave this one a six out of five as well. And um, just an absolutely unbelievable song. This one even had cleans, and it's very rare when you hear any cleans out of any Within the Ruins song, but the uncleans were just phenomenal and just completely brutal in general. And just the, I think either two or three guitar, at least two guitar solos, and either two or three breakdowns was definitely a top five, was definitely top five worthy on this list. Coming in at number four is Contraband by Make Them Suffer, song review number 312, the only recommendation that made it on my top 10 list, and definitely worthy of one too. Eye popping cleans, great, insane, just absolutely brutal gutturals, and great guitar, catchy chorus, and definitely one of the song, one of the best songs of 2021, and just amazing in general. Um, I was definitely thinking about putting this at number three, but the number three spot was is the reason why I will get to in a second is the reason why this made it top four, but. Just a great song overall, along with um, Courtney LaPlante being featured in this song, it was just great. Coming in at number 3 is Butterfly Effect by N Chaos, song review number 369. This one also got a 6 out of 5, and the reason this scored, or this rated higher than Contraband, is this song, the clean vocalist in this song, has is probably the best clean vocalist I have ever heard in my entire life. You cannot beat her clean vocals with a freaking stick. If you don't believe me, you can go listen to Butterfly Effect by N Chaos yourself, if you don't believe me, and you will hear for yourself, I should say. And just great overall. I mean, guitar riffing just on freaking point. The drums, absolutely amazing. The uncleans by the unclean vocalists were great. This is a Chinese metalcore band, and it's rare when you hear any any like metal from China or metal metalcore from China. It's just absolutely amazing. This song was, I mean, these top three are definitely set in stone. The bottom seven are interchangeable here and there, but these top three are set in stone, and that comes in at number three on my top ten list. Very deserving of it as well. Coming in at number two is Visualized by Abiogenesis, song review number 61. Going back to the first 100 once again. Uh, this song, just, just the instruments in general, the instrumental talent and instrumentals overall were just insane. The guitar was great, great guitar solo, fast and super powerful drumming, and the unclean vocalist's gutturals and even his screams were insane. Great, just brutal, insane, ridiculous chorus, and just the, oh, the guitar ripping overall was just insane. The instrumentals in general were insane. I think, I want to say I gave this a 10 out of 5, and my only 10 out of 5 out of these um, top 10 song reviews. Before I get to my number one pick, which... I think all of y'all should know it by now if you don't already. Here are 15 honorable mentions from earliest to most recent. And I'm just going to run through them, okay? Here we go. After the um, A Pulse Exchanged by After the Burial, song review number 44. Lost in the Static by After the Burial, song review number 117. Defeated by If I Were You, song review number 125. My Nemesis by Impending Doom, song review number 158. System Failure by If I Were You, song review number 175. Under Your Tattoos by Anna Is Okay, song review number 219. Watch the World Burn by The Healing, song review number 228. The War That Followed Me Home by Conviction, song review number 239. Wreckage by Conviction, song review number 251. Rescue Me by If I Were You, song review number 271. Blood and Water by Memphis Mayfire, song review number 294. Save Me Now by Carissa Pascarella, song review number 332. Time Bomb by Motionless and White, song review number 362. Undertow by As I Lay Dying, song review number 367. And Alone Art by Mart Life, song review number 500. Now... Everyone should know it by now. My number one song review on my top 10 song reviews list, all the way from 1 to 500, is the remastered version of The Choice by If I Were You, song review number 405. This song got a 25 out of 5 for me. It is by 
far the best song review out of all 500 of my song reviews and the remastered version of the choice is just absolutely insane and it is awesome great guitar solo great eye-popping cleans from randy pascarella i mentioned um his sister on my honorable mentions list and great uncleans from kyle and just an absolutely insane song overall and the last part of the song after the the guitar solo was what completely wins it over for me this is my favorite song out of their entire discography and not only does it get number one on my top 10 song reviews list from 1 to 500 i would go as far as to put this in my top 10 of all of my favorite songs that i have ever heard from anyone honestly i would put this easily in my top 10 maybe even my top five i like this song so much that i would give it that title honestly and this song in general along with the great chorus was just insane so many different instrumentals so many different ranges of vocals both clean and unclean and just an absolutely amazing song overall definitely worthy of the number one spot on my top 10 song review list from 1 to 500. So those are my top 10 song reviews from song reviews 1 to 500. Hit me up in the comment section below. Let me know what you think about my list and let me know if what some of your favorite song reviews were from 1 through 500. This list was absolutely so hard to compile. Like I said, the top three are pretty much set in stone, but the other seven were so hard to compile and I am glad I decided to do it because this was definitely a fun video to make overall. And remember, I'm going to be uploading this tomorrow, even though I'm recording it on Tuesday, I'm going to be uploading it tomorrow, which is Wednesday. But I am uh, so glad that I decided to do this top 10 list. I hope you all enjoyed this video. I hope you all, I hope some of yours made honorable mentions or in my top 10. And let me know, like I said, hit me up in the comment section below. Let me know what some of your favorite song reviews were from 1 through 500. But if you liked what you saw in this video, please go ahead and give it a thumbs up. Hit that subscribe button and comment below. And I will see you guys next time with another video. This is Steven signing out.